What Anovio has done now is, is not only create a, a technology that works, but a strategy that can actually become commercialized. They've got emerging technologies to achieve things never before possible. Anovio will be opening a new technology that we have all been dreaming about They've accumulated an, an, an you know, enormously high quality group, people with enormous experience in those fields. And then they've also garnered some people who are from industry, who've had enormous success in providing the insights of how you go from a great idea to a, a product that you can actually make and you can actually deliver it to a large number of people. That's what Inovio is doing. And the scientific advisory board of Inovio is made of people who are very, very prominent scientists and leaders in the field. And it is very important. It is a test, it is a proof that you are on a very significant pathway. I mean, there are other people trying to play with it, but I think uh, Inovio has a dominant IP situation and it's certainly much more advanced than anybody else. I think from a scientific standpoint, my guess is there will be a lot of people who will jump on a bandwagon. What that will do is that will probably ultimately help move the science further. I think from a commercial standpoint, an overview is really the people who can control it and, and advance it. The, uh, the data that are being produced uh, by an OVO are certainly uh, far ahead of anybody else. What Inovio has done is steadily improve the technology by different modes of electroporation by adding adjuvants, by optimizing sequences, and a whole series of things, which has now got to a stage where the number of activated cells is really quite significant. The critical thing now is the trial that's ongoing with HPV, which I think has one of the highest chances of success. You can eradicate persistent lifelong AIDS infections, tumors, persistent hepatitis C, hepatitis B virus infections. I mean, we're talking about, uh, with the various ones, at least one billion people around the world. Some of the approaches that are being pursued here in terms of making a universal flu vaccine could have an enormous impact on, on world health, actually. Um, and of course, an HIV vaccine, which is, which is also being pursued. We're talking about strategies that may be able to cure people with minimal to no toxicity. And Anovio's strategy of generating responses is definitely a really important part of that. And if it works, you will have many applications. And, and you just look at what Anovio has in its pipeline. It has multiple other uh, products that can come uh, through and it will really be a new wave of success in the field of vaccinology. The possibilities are limitless.